need to visit your inbox every day. That, that, that's one of, the, one of the critical things. I mean, my gosh, if something pops into your inbox, it's good. You shouldn't wait too long to go back. I mean, 24 hours is the maximum amount of time. You'd really want to wait on something that came in through your inbox in a, in a, in a good way. Um, a lot of people will, will have uh, their phones um, and their, their, their mobile devices and stuff, you know, be able to do things for them. So I'm going to share something with you that almost nobody knows. It's one of my personal techniques. Okay. So on my, on my iPhone here, and I'm not going to go get the app out, although that's, there's the, uh, that's the Paul McCartney concert in Minneapolis there. Um, uh, my desktop here is, as well on, the, on my MacBook Pro has that as well. Um, but uh, if, you, if you use a combination of your phone and your computer here, you can save some time. Let me share how. The application here, as you, as you look and see the invitations that come in, it will show you when somebody has sent an invitation that has a custom message. Otherwise, it just goes through. You just see a list of people, and all of a sudden down here, someone who's got a custom message, and it sticks out. So I'll have my phone by me here, and I'll manage. I'll make sure that I, that I return um, my, my messages and my accept those invitations and send, send thank yous to those people who customize first. So there's a tip. To, you know, use your phone and the app here kind of as a – as a one, two to see that. Um, I get 20, 30, 40 a day now. Um, I used to get 100 a day, but I turned a lot of, a lot of things off because my network's so big. I have to delete 100 people to add 100 people. I got to delete one to add one. And it get, it's getting kind of hard now. I, am, I mean, uh, I've deleted over 20,000 people from my network. I'm the most disconnected person you're going to have on this show. Um, at one time, you couldn't even delete on LinkedIn because it didn't work. It timed out. It would just go woo like that. Couldn't even delete. So the folks at LinkedIn actually went in and deleted entire countries for me. I picked 16 countries, and they just wiped everybody from those countries out. Um, that's what I had to do to free up like 4,000 so I could accept the next 4,000 that had already come in. Got a little crazy out there. It's not, not part of what I'm, I'm, I'm about anymore, but at one time, the, the LinkedIn online uh, open networker lion, lion world and the, and the top link world were really what, what was driving the, the innovation. The, the people that were part of those networks that were bought into that were the big leaders, big mofo people. And, and those are the folks that if you look at the, the people that got to 30,000 connections on LinkedIn, I was like number 10 or so to max out. Most of them were using some sort of a tool or system. It wasn't just a random thing, and I was part of, part of that as well. So, um, but then, you know, once you're connected to lots of people, now it's like I got to delete 10 to add 10. Well, I'm going to de delete 10 from the bottom and add 10 more great people at the top. And I, I accept about two-thirds of the invitations that come in to me now. It used to be 100%, and I used to send thank you messages to everybody. And I just, I just don't anymore. I guess you could say it's, it's matured a bit. But my advice for people, get into your LinkedIn inbox the other thing is the people that you're talking to in email, invite them along the way. I invite people that I'm involved in conversations with while I'm involved in conversations with them. Not later or something. I try to do it while we're, while we're active. 